Hey guys and girls, it's uh, Mike from Shallow666. Um, just wanted to share a couple quick uh, quick uh, things I got. Um, things I wanted to share. Um, anyway, I want to talk about this band called Dismo. Um, Dismo uh, starts around 2005. Um, they put their first demo out in 2009. Uh, they're Jersey, Jersey, New Jersey uh, guys. Uh, the singer Craig Pillard was in one of my favorite bands uh, back in the early 90s. Uh, Incantation, Onward to Golgotha. And uh, he went on to do probably one of my favorite records ever. Um, it didn't get the the light um, that it should have. Um, the band Disciples of Mockery. But we're not talking about that right now. We're going to talk about Dizma. Anyway, uh, Dizma puts out this demo, uh, 2009. Um, it's it's great. And uh, shortly thereafter, they get picked up by Profound Bore, and they put out toward the Megalith. Um, but this demo. The Vault of Membros was re-released. I never got the opportunity to get the demo. I don't know if it was only out on tape. They might have just put it out on cassette or whatever. Uh, eventually, they make it available here through uh, D-Test Records, which is out of Belgium. Um, yeah, this is basically the demo with a bonus track of a live song, which the other, the, all the songs on here. Lost in Burial Fog, Vault of Membros, Chaos Apparition, all these are on Port the Megalith album. Um, I just like to have these old rarities where they record. This is heavy. Um, I don't know if this is actually heavier than the album. Um, I want to be, I want to be one of those purists and say, well, the demo's heavier. I mean, they capture it's heavy on here, definitely. Um, it might actually be heavier on the album, but. Um, just because they had a little bit of money to make the production here, but um, this is definitely uh, definitely cool to own um, for somebody who didn't get to pick it up. But anyway, it's got the old school style death metal uh, gatefold with the lyrics. I like having the lyrics. Um, you know, good band photo up here. Nice package. Um, Came with a red, came on red. I didn't really, I don't know if I knew that at the time. I this came out in 2012. So it's nice. It sounds, the record itself sounds good. You know what I mean? Um, sometimes you can get some, just some records that don't sound so great. Um, even if the production is good, just the way they, they put it down on wax, man. Sometimes it, Certain productions don't apply well to wax. They gotta remix shit, to make it sound okay. Um, I don't even know if this thing is still available, man. I just wanted to just wanted to show it quick. Um, I really like this. Again, Dizma is a uh, you know um, been around for eight or nine years now. Um, they're all veterans of the scene. I know they lost their original drummer recently, so there's already been a member change. Um, his name eludes me, and I know he's a he's a vital player in the, in, in the death metal scene. But uh, they did get the, I believe the original drummer from Immolation is playing for for Dizma right now. But um, don't quote me on that. Um, real quick, what you definitely can get. Uh, this is embarrassing. I only have the CD, but. Um, Toward the megalith. This is great record, um, and this is a great package, man. I mean, this is done by Profound Lore. Uh, comes with a nice old school um, diesel style package with uh, nice inlays and lyrics. Remember, uh, I don't know. I don't buy stuff that much anymore. I do like to buy some. 
stuff that I really, really like and want to want to own. I'll grab it on vinyl. But um, <clears throat> they are uh, the really, really dark, doomy, disgusting version of death metal. There's no... Um, there's, it's not catchy here, guys. It's not here for that. It's to... Craig Pillard's vocals on everything I've heard so far, and including on this, smother. Smother. Um, that's the best way to put it. His, he's just got some guttural thing that's... It just kind of makes the whole album have this atmosphere over it. Um, and it's, 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 it's just a huge, uh, it's, it's a, it's a huge atmospheric wind for lack of better term that, that comes over, it rattles, they make sure it's front and it's focal on the recordings and it, it gives it its own thing. It's, his vocal is very identifiable, um, and it's, it's horrifying. It's scary scary um so anyway um the vault of membros and uh toward the megalith if you like your death metal slow there is fast stuff on there don't get me wrong um i'd say they are um you know of the death doom category uh i don't know if they like the analogy but if you like incantation you probably would like dysma um you know at least early incantation um, not that their sound has changed a whole lot, but um, definitely check it out. And uh, thank you for watching.